National Goof Off Day was made to let you goof off and is the day we celebrate goofballs in their own forms and take a lesson. Wow, that's really interesting. Yeah, can you tell them more about this day? Of course. The National Goof Off Day gives us a chance to erase the memory of hectic work and deadlines and relax for a day. Break through the commitments and let the crazy out. It also lets us be ourselves for a day without worrying about what people would think because everyone would probably be acting crazy on this day. Oh my lord. I know, right? Anyways, let's go on to the word of the day. The word of the day is forthcoming. Forthcoming? That's cool. Yep, but can you tell them what it means? Of course. Forthcoming means planned for or about to happen in the near future. Oh, wow. Would you like to tell them an example sentence? Sure. Here's an example. He was more forthcoming about his past than they expected. You could also use, she has been less forthcoming about her involvement in the scandal. Wow, that's interesting. Well, I think it's time to move on to this day in history, don't you think? Yeah, I do. Having completed the first U.S. Overland Expedition to the Pacific Coast, explorers Meriwether Lewis and William Clark this day in 1806 began their return to St. Louis, Missouri, where their journey had begun in May 1804. That's really cool. I know, right? I didn't even know that. <laughs> the lunch for today is chicken alfredo, club flatbread, harvest chicken salad, baked beans, fresh veggie tray with ranch, and fruit tray. Wow, that sounds so good. It's making me so hungry. <laughs> Anyways, that's all, DSA. We hope y'all have a great day. We, we love, love you. you. Oh, you wow, okay, I see how it is. <laughs> we hope you have, you. What? I'm sorry, it's been a long time. <laughs>